Hello there, I'm Tom Smart from Smart Aerials and welcome to video number four of our DIY series and today's video is how to make a right angled uh, coax plug. Um, now the reason why you might want to make a right angled coax plug is you might have a TV up on the wall uh, and the connection might be so tight that you can't, you can't get the natural bend of the cable in there so if we get a right angled plug on there we get the TV much more snug to the window uh, and we don't run the risk of damaging the TV or breaking the cable so that's why you might, why you might want to use this. Uh, tools we're going to need today are one set of cutters, one standing knife, one beaten up screwdriver. By the way, the beaten up bit isn't compulsory, you can use a good one. <laughs> it's, got, it's just a flathead screwdriver, just you know, any, any old one would do. Uh, and one right angle plug. We'll be taking this apart, but basically that looks like that. Um, so I'm going to come close to the video camera so you, so you can see what I'm doing. Um, Okay. First things first, we're going to, uh, hello there by the way, <laughs> we're going to bear back the cable, uh, we don't need a lot, I need just about a centimetre and a half, we plenty. Um, so we're going to bear that back and we just make a nice little round cut around uh, the cable. You probably notice I'm pressing quite hard there, that's because my standing knife is a bit blunt. Um, uh, until we've got that, uh, now what we're doing, we're going to pull back the braid, pull back the the screen, uh, to the left with just the, the braid and the dielectric there, that's that white bit. Uh, and we're going to grab the stone off again and cut it about so far. Um, depending on which uh, right angle connector you've got, it might change the way you do this. Um, you know, you might have to bear back different lengths, but uh, when, when I get all together, it, it will make sense how you do it. So we're going to get that back like that. So we, we, to, <laughs> We're pulling the braid so it's, it's like that. Um, so that's never going to touch that. As soon as you touch that, it won't work. Um, and I'm going to cut that about there. Now, before you go any further, remember to put this bit on, this little spinny bit. That's got to go on. So if you do everything else, then you're going to have to take it all back off again. Uh, just put that bit on. So we've got that on, then we can forget about that for the moment. Um, and we've got this bit. Uh, so what this bit does, it's, uh, it's got a little screw there. I'm going to wait for that focus. It's probably focusing now. That's it, yeah, <laughs> got there in the end. Um, we're going to loosen that screw off. If I get it in there. Oh, it's a tight one. Get that in there. Oh, I'm sure you know which way this is going now, which way the video is going. Um, so we've got that loosened off just enough uh, to get that to go in there. So that will just poke in there, like that. I'm going to do it back up again, like so. Don't don't keep going with that screw and loosen it right off because it so, so they can be so fiddly. Sometimes a bit of a job to get them back on again. Um, and the final remaining bit is like the sort of like the back bit. Uh, press them hard together. Uh, instantly, this is a, a Televez plug. Which, they're quite a good plugs. So if you if, you, if you're going to buy some, I recommend getting these ones. Or the Televez F series, which are even better, but they're, they're about a couple of quid a plug. So. Yeah, these ones we do plenty. And we just tighten up as tight as we can get that. So it's like that. So we've got a nice screen connection, it's all in the metal housing, uh, and that will go into the back of the TV uh, and it, it won't press against the wall, it'll come straight down. Um, so I hope this video has been of, of use to you. If, if it was, if you did like it, please do make sure you give it a thumbs up or give it a like wherever you're watching this. Uh, please do leave a comment below. Um, you know any requests for any further videos? Get them in there because I'll, 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 I'll make make sure that I make that video. Uh, and please do subscribe to our YouTube channel because we're going to do a whole series uh, of these videos. Of it's going to cover everything right from data cabling to putting aerials up to put satellite dishes up. So there's a lot of worth there. So um, I've been Tom Smart from Smart Hills, and I am guaranteeing you a good reception. Bye.